Howdy, guitar players. Today I wanted to talk about the blues scales. Some might say that I should first introduce the pentatonic scale, but I'll save that for later. Because, well, when you feel blue, you feel like playing the blues. After all, it's been election week and it's still not over. Anyway, since I build guitars, I have a lot hanging on the walls and so have the luxury of being able to have different... What? <laughs> different guitars tuned in different keys. Open G is the most common, which is G, D, G. But open E is another common one, and it's tuned E, B, E. So I figured it would be easier to introduce this scale on a guitar tuned in E. The notes are E, G, A, B flat, B and D. Here's my taped up guitar neck for the E minor blues scale. Again, here's how it sounds. cheating, but playing a new scale is so much easier with tape dots on the right places. But most scar box guitars are tuned in open G. How does the E minor blues scale sound there? I wondered, so I pulled out another guitar. This one. And I've got it taped up to the E, uh, sorry, the E minor blues scale. What's missing is that low E. Your lowest note on a guitar tuned in open G is, well, a G. So to find resolution when you're descending, you'll have to fudge it and jump an octave to the to fret the middle string on the second fret. Here's how it sounds. playing the E minor blues on a guitar tuned 
in E. So I got another guitar that was tuned to G, and I taped it up to the G minor blues scale. Scale, you know, it would go G, B flat, C, D, and A. This is much more common in rock and roll. Here it is. your blues away. For me, a lot of music is about feeling and expressing myself and also healing. <laughs> 